Once there was a king who loved sculptures very much. He used to collect sculptures from around the world and bring them to his palace. There were many sculptures in his palace, but among them all, he loved three sculptures the most. Everyone knew that the king had great affection for those sculptures. One day when the servant was cleaning sculptures, he accidentally broke one of his favorite sculptures. When the king came to know about it, he got very angry and immediately gave the death sentence to servant. After hearing the sentence, the servant immediately broke the other two sculptures, which King liked the most. Everyone was surprised to see this. King asked his soldiers to bring servants to his court. When the servant came, the king asked, Why did you break the other two sculptures? Servant said, My lord, these sculptures were made of clay and were very fragile. They have not come with the boon of immortality. If not today, tomorrow they would have broken. If it had been broken by someone like me, then he would also have to face the death penalty without any reason. I already got the death penalty, so I saved the lives of two people by breaking other two sculptures. Hearing this, King realized his mistake and freed the servant from punishment. Servant taught the king the value of life. The king loved sculptures, but it was against justice for him to give a death sentence to the servant. Sitting on the chair of justice, one should give a decision fairly, not getting affected by his personal feelings. The king understood that servant was many times better than him. It was this servant who, despite being so close to death, thought of goodness. A person in high post has responsibility, and because of his personal love, giving the death penalty for a small crime is an insult to that seat. Whether it is a king, or whoever is chosen to do justice, should understand the importance of justice. Thank you for watching our video. If you have liked the story, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more exciting stories. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.